Streaming video or calling over the internet is sometimes taken for granted in the United States. But in most parts of Africa, it has not been possible for slow and patchy internet services, relying heavily on limited and expensive satellite links. Technology is basically using sound through waves in the atmosphere. And that tends to be very slow when you are transmitting voice, video and data. This is what we call latency or the delay in the signals. But now we are moving over to fiber optic cable technology, which transmits at the speed of light. Now a new undersea fiber optic cable links West Africa to Europe and the rest of the world. Business analysts say the cable paves the way for a transformation in internet access and will enable service providers to offer cheaper and more reliable internet services. We welcome every improvement in the speed because if you visit some other countries just as far as uh, South Africa, their internet is quite faster. Participants from Bangalore, London and Johannesburg took part in the launch using the teleconferencing facilities not previously possible in Nigeria hosted by the U.S. router maker Cisco Systems, which is participating with Main One to develop applications for the Nigerian market. What we see for our customers is just a much, much better, faster, quicker broadband service to their mobile phones and to their laptops. And boy, you know, this market is really crying out for it. Uh, there is a tremendous pent-up demand there, and I think this is the beginning of a new era, actually, in terms of broadband connectivity into Nigeria. In neighboring Togo, wireless internet is becoming more accessible with the introduction of USB modems, providing a faster internet connection. When the fiber comes in, I think the speeds will go up and we hope the prices will come down as they are telling you. Okay, considering the speed of the internet, it's quite slow in cyber cafes and that makes it very expensive. Since last year, Togo Telecom, the country's public telecoms operator, has been working to dramatically increase the country's internet capabilities. Mobile phone service provider Move Togo is also providing wireless internet. Qu'est-ce qui motive cela C'est d'abord notre engagement à démocratiser, à révolutionner le, le, le marché de la téléphonie au Togo, mais également à démocratiser les services mobiles. Aujourd'hui, pour nous, le, le, le mobile n'est pas un luxe, ni l'Internet. Millions de people in rural parts of Africa are not yet covered by any mobile phone network, let alone one that would support the Internet access. To do that, many business analysts say that the countries need to build a viable infrastructure, set up regional exchanges, and provide connectivity to homes and businesses. Paul Liho, VON News.